Hey you guys, welcome back to the channel, ScooterATVSales.com, bringing you the Apollo RFZ DB32 110cc 4-stroke, four 4-speed, four semi-automatic ATV, you guys. Actually dirt bike, all-terrain vehicle, so anyways, I'm going to show you guys this uh, dirt bike. It's by Apollo. It's the RFZ DB32 model. The cross uh, competitor to this one on Apollo would be the X4. You guys can look that and scroll down and find a video that I've done on the X4 model. I do like this model and prefer this model in regards to the frame, the way it's set up. Same top quality as the X4. This is uh, a really nice beginner's dirt bike for kids, a smaller rider. Four speed semi automatic kick start again, four stroke. It has the 12 inch wheels in, in the back and then the 14s in the front. Really nice setup, great looking graphics. Again, uh, Apollo, as I mentioned in other videos, Apollo is on the coattails of a Honda in regards to quality. Great value in all these uh, dirt bikes and also their ATVs. This has the uh, disc brakes in the back area. I'm on the left, right side here of, of the red one here, and then we got some disc brakes in the front as well. We got the blue color and we got the red color over here. RFZ 28 inch seat height, you guys. 28 inch seat height from the ground up. So definitely for the uh, shorter rider, beginner rider, get four speed semi automatic, good quality. Again, the cross model would be the X4 from Apollo. It has a different frame setup. So depending on what you want, what you're after, depending on uh, the styling that you choose here on the DB32 or the X4. Now, the other brand would be the uh, Tau Motors DB14 semi-automatic. This resembles that particular one. But if I was to choose out of both, I do like the way this sits, the frame, the comfort. It's a really nice, really nice, well done by Apollo RFZ DB32. It has a metal gas cap that's included on it right here. Okay, the gas tanks are just short of a gallon here. It has a uh, ignition over here, switch. This is a switch, you guys, as well as the switch over here on the left side of the handlebar right here. And then again, a kickstart here on the right side. It has some really nice solid foot pegs on it here. Rear brake operates your rear brake area, and then this here operates your front brakes as well. Again, great beginners dirt bike four stroke. I have the red one running so you guys can hear it run. I'm not going to test drive this, we don't have anybody to test drive it. We're too far too large and uh, tall for this uh, for these beginner dirt bikes. Again, scroll down and check out the Tom Motors DB14 semi automatic 110. And then the X4 by Apollo. You guys can see the full videos and demo. Again, the specs are all on our website, scooteratvsales.com. You guys need some detailed spec information. There's a nice setup here with the manual choke. Here on the left side. Decent uh, air filter system. Again, this is all the EPA stuff that they are uh, required to have on, uh, on these dirt bikes now. This stuff here is all the EPA with the crank uh, breather here. The other side here, really decent. Piece of carburetors on it with uh, idle adjustment, four stroke, chain driven, nice hard plastic uh, chain guard on it. Decent swing arm here on the back. Disc brakes all the way around, huge value, you guys. Check these out. These are available here at our Northern Nevada storefront. If you're out of state, always call before ordering so we can confirm availability. ScooterATVSales.com If you guys are looking for some parts It's at ScooterATVParts.com If you're looking for specific Tau Tau parts It'd be Tau Tau ScooterATVParts.com And you can always find us on Instagram At ScooterATVSales You guys hope all is well And uh, we'll see you guys soon Take care Bye bye